I'm Ryan Herrer taking a closer look at an effort to slow the massive virus spread in Colorado's prisons. On Wednesday, the ACLU of Colorado asked a Denver District Court judge for an emergency order to release inmates in overcrowded prisons. The motion alleges that Democratic Governor Jared Polis has not done enough to protect offenders currently experiencing massive outbreaks in several facilities. ACLU lawyers argue that keeping prisons at high capacities is cruel and unusual punishment in what appears to be an overwhelmed system. Their lawyers say people testing positive for COVID are sometimes being housed with those who are healthy and that it's affecting everything from meals to medical care. The ACLU solution? Get a judge to let inmates out. While the ACLU is not asking for a specific number to be released, their attorney, Anna Holland Edwards, says estimates show freeing 1,800 to 3,000 prisoners would create the physical distancing needed to slow spread on the inside. You know, Governor Polis knows that this is necessary. In the original executive orders, he gave powers to the Department of Corrections to reduce the population, but he let those powers elapse and he didn't renew them. So this is asking him to put back in place what he already knew was needed. Now that it's even more needed, you know, four people have died while I was writing this motion. Under the first executive order, about 300 inmates were released with controversy. Cornelius Haney was one of those released. He's back in jail, accused of murdering a young woman. The motion filed Wednesday stresses that those released should not pose a risk to the public. Both the Department of Corrections and the governor's office declined to comment on this story. Holland Edwards hopes for another court hearing in the next 45 days. In Denver, Brian Herr, 9 News.